Hey everyone, it's the, the Unpro Pro here, and welcome to the next little tutorial thing. Uh, this was requested by, well, I, I forgot his name offhand, but um, you can see it in the, I know, okay, okay, I know, Windows, the trick is all the yeah, yeah. Uh, anyways, um, <clears throat> yeah, his name is in the title. He requested uh, about importing tile sets, so I went ahead and I made a tile set, off, you know, obviously off camera. It's nothing really special, I just edited the ones that they already had, just to make it a little more vibrant, I guess. I kind of changed it, just a little bit of things. Uh, first thing you want to do is go into your database by pressing F5 or clicking up there. And uh, now you want to go to Tile Sets. Click Change Maximum, uh, increase it by 1. So I got 5 here. Name it, uh, outside, wait, interior, wait, back and it, exterior. Exteriors, yes, exteriors. <laughs> uh, okay, hang on. Just look at this one right here. It says area type. VX compatible would be like it's kind of hard to explain. Um, VX kind of use different ways of tiling. Uh, if you if you if you want to import VX maps, you you can just by uh, selecting VX compatible. Anyway, so we're going to be doing area type, and field type uh, would be like this, um, or everything is a little different. Um, <laughs> oh, best, the best description ever. Uh, anyways, exterior's vibrant. <laughs> Makes me want cereal. Now, okay, we didn't we didn't import it yet. So what you got to do is, after you set all that up, um, go to resource manager. Go to tile sets, graphics slash tile sets. Uh, and I'm going to import it from the things that I made here. Just press Control A and you can select everything, or you can just select them one at a time. Click clear on these if you don't have a transparent color. If you do, well, I don't know. Just click the transparent color. With, uh, if you normal click it, it'll be transparent. If you right click it, it makes it semi transparent, like kind of see through. And uh, well, as you can see, it already changed. Uh, it's already different. It's a little more dark and colorful. Like, let me get out of this thing. I'll show you and see. Uh, basically, all I did, like, to change it, was like just to add like a small, kind of like a grain effect, but and darken it and give it a little more contrast at the same time. Exterior is vibrant. <laughs> uh, you would just um, import it like like so. A one, and you would look for this type of tile set which is the A1 A1 steak sauce uh, A2 is ground and you see it's already named here but it won't always be named if you just download them like this I mean they should but if they're not just by looking like you can, can kinda compare uh, with the original the ground stuff like this and the fences this would go on A2 uh, A3 is buildings it, it, it explains it right here um, A3 a4 and a5 and then you got tile B, C, D, and E. Uh, e is basically the same thing as all the rest of these. Uh, they're just different layers that you can have. Uh, right now this does have B and C but say you wanted more like um, I'll show you. If you go here and you go to tile sets and dungeon B is a lot different So is C. So say you wanted C, you would just export it to whatever folder you want to, go back, and then you would import it as D instead. Well, you don't need to export it, actually. I, that's a derp. That was a derp move of me. You don't even really need to, um, I don't think it really matters. Uh, anyways, right-click and go to Map Properties, and you, then you can select your, uh, your new tile set you made. Exterior is vibrant. <laughs> Uh, yeah, see, that's basically all that is, though, where you can just kind of select different layers. And this allows this allows for um, some rather nice customized, like, customization, actually. You see how you got, like, the top missing up here, but that's okay, because you got the right here. Um, if you really want to go all out, you can have, like, the world's largest tile set, I guess, and have everything up in here. Some books, and you get E. And really, that's all there is to it. 
Your son. You don't have moved here. No, no. No, no. Best mapping ever. Not really. What the heck are these things? Like, I never really actually... This looks kind of cool. <laughs> Alright, but anyways, so that's that's uh, how you how you do tile sets. Uh, it doesn't have to be named that way, again. Like, it can be named however you want to name it. But that's, that's um, basically the way to show you, I guess. Alright, hope this helped.